Trevor Hickey at Rock Metal Fiend. Is there any chance in your mind, Mike, that Josh Levo makes the team full time? I think he'll make the 23 man roster, but the question is, will he play? And that's been the question the last two years. And I think he's in the mix. But if you look at it right now, if you calculate the depth chart, um, you know, it's Tyler Ennis, Levo, Casper Kapanen. Um, you know, they're, they're sort of in the mix for the, uh, the wings on the fourth line. And I mean, they bring in Tyler Ennis on a, on a one-way deal after he gets bought out by Minnesota and he, you know, he has been a a three or four time 20 goal scorer. So, you know, he might be a luxury to have on the fourth line if he regains, you know, anything more close to his top form when he was at the Sabres and Casper Kapanen is, you know, we know he's an up and coming player. I mean, Levo's going to, it's, it's, it's going to be tough for him to, I mean, I think he'll make the 23 if he stays with the Leafs, but if he doesn't make it, you know, they're not going to send him down because they don't want to lose him for nothing. But I I have a feeling that Kyle Dubas, if he doesn't make it this time, you know, maybe there's an opportunity for them to move him elsewhere and maybe get something that can help him. I mean, he's a good, he's a good kid and a good young player. And I think elsewhere he could score 15, you know, maybe 20 goals if he got, regular ice time but i just don't know whether he'll get that with the leafs being a part of this organization from the get-go and hoping to be a contributor in some capacity and the leafs bring in players who he has to fight to get a job for you know it's it's incredible and it has to be demoralizing yeah and maybe you know maybe tyler innes is that 13th forward maybe he's the guy who you know is the veteran guy who will sit in the press box and they will give levo an opportunity you know if they give him an opportunity on the fourth line and that's the thing though the, how much opportunity in terms of ice time will the fourth line get when you have matthews tavares and Kadri as your top three centers and those lines you know i've heard, i've actually heard some people who think that they should go with 11 forwards and seven defensemen because you know they can ro- they could rotate the fourth line wingers, play them with Tavares, play them with Matthews and have an extra defenseman who can be a specialist. So, I mean, nothing, nothing is, you know, anything is up for this team. They, they will, they will try anything and Babcock is inventive. And so uh, is Dubas. So we'll, we'll see what happens after training camp.